Philadelphia police are investigating a disturbing crime pattern in southwest Philadelphia. They believe the same man is responsible for two gunpoint sexual assaults over the weekend. Action reporter Caroline Goggin is live outside of the Special Victims Unit in Hunting Park with the details. Caroline. Well, Rick, as police continue investigating, they say they're also looking for surveillance video of the suspect. They say as soon as they have that, they're going to release it to the public as they try to track this guy down. We want to make sure we catch this offender before he escalates any further. The search is on for a man who police say raped two women at gunpoint in southwest Philadelphia over the weekend. And based on the M.O., physical description, and geographical location, we believe that they were likely committed by the same offender. The first incident happened at 3 o'clock on Saturday morning on the 1600 block of South 55th Street. According to police, a man approached a woman as she was sitting in her car at a traffic light. With a small handgun, he demanded money. After she gave him $20, police say he ordered her to unlock her car. He got in and had her drive to St. Bernard Street where he sexually assaulted her. Police say he then had her drive to an ATM on the 5500 block of Chestnut to withdraw money. He took that money and left. Police are now investigating whether he also got away with the victim's AirPods. It has to be soul crushing. Your whole sense of being has just been destroyed. Your sense of safety has just been destroyed. The other incident happened Sunday evening at 5 o'clock on the 1100 block of South Paxson Street. Police say a woman was walking in the area when a man came up behind her, pointed a handgun and demanded money. She gave him $25 and some prescription medication she had, but he then forced her into an alleyway and sexually assaulted her. Captain Eileen Parker calls this a heinous act. I actually grew up in the area, so um, I was very, very shocked and, and wanted to make sure that this was put out as soon as possible, as we do with all our jobs. And police are asking anyone with information about these two incidents to either call the Special Victims Unit or to call their tip line at 215-686-TIPS. We are live in Hunting Park. I'm Caroline Goggin, Channel 6 Action News. Sarah? Yeah, hopefully they track this person down quickly. Caroline, thank you.